Hello, people of the interwebs. Welcome back. We are doing another unboxing of Tokidoki Unicornos. This one is their latest Frozen Treat series. I only got one case because, frankly, I have no space and I don't even know where I'm going to put these. But they look super cute from the stock photos, so I'm excited to get into this. Um, let me show you what the case looks like because it's really cute. It's like a little ice cream truck. Do you see that? This would make a really great background for anybody who needs or keeps backgrounds for display. Again, I don't have the space, but I'm so tempted because these are so cute. So this is a series of what you can get. Um, in the last like, year or two, I've really tried not to see too many details because I like being surprised. So... I don't even really know other than I know that this one is a recolor uh, of a um, uh, like a regular one from a couple series ago. So um, I saw people talking about that. But the rest of these I really haven't looked at all that much. The colors look really pretty. So I'm excited to open these. Um, apparently this chase is a 1 in 48 and there's 8 I think in a case. So there's a pretty good chance I'm not going to get it, but I'm like not dying for it. So I really don't care. I just really want to open these, see what they look like. Um, based on the colors, I'm probably going to hang on to most of these because they're so pretty. And again, look at this box, you guys. And even the back is the back of an ice cream truck. It's so cute. Anyway, so let me go ahead and open this. And this would be the pop-up for anyone that cares. This is what the pop-up would look like. I'm going to write that. Um, if you saw it at a Hot Topic or something. I am just going to fold it back because I'm not going to keep it. And I'm going to fold these back. And uh, I'm actually... <laughs> this is interesting. I wonder if this is a chase because it's sideways. Who knows? Anyway, I'm going to put this off to the side. And then I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit. So that we can get a closer look at these. And we are going to get started. So this is what... The, oh, cute. It looks like a little pint container. This is what the... Um, the box looks like, and I'll show you guys one, and then the rest, it'll be all the same. So, the little unicorn story, but the the little pint, and there's, oh, I love this. This is like the um, the universe uh, make it mini or whatever, uh, fa um, nutritional facts. So, it says calories, zero, calories from fun, zero. Uh, serving size is one figure, by the way. Figure in pint is one. Uh, total fun, 100%. Saturated fun, 100% cuteness 100%, sweetness 100%, total characters 9, unicornos 100, tokidoki 100. I love this. This is so cute. These are the kind of details that really make me happy about, you know, paying for an uh, art toy as opposed to just a regular toy. Also, this is new to me. They have a bit of a, a sticker of authenticity, I'm assuming. You can see the, the heart with the crossbows, bones, so I'm um, not sure if there's issues with... Uh, fakes but here it is so here's the box we're gonna open it I love this color combo this bright blue and this pink is really pretty so I'm gonna go ahead and open this they don't seem to have a thumb press so I'm gonna open the top okay and I'll show you guys the oh okay so this is again part of that stickers thing so they have I'll show you guys the sticker this is the sticker it's shiny it's uh it's easy to peel there's that but uh, from my experience, they will all be the same, which again, I've said this before, I, I don't see the point in these because they're all the same. So then if you buy a case, you're going to get eight of these and then like, what are you going to do? And I don't know. It's just not my thing. Anyway, um, so here's the collector's card. Um, and I love that they include these actually. So here they are. Give you guys a close look. Really cute. Love the colors. And we will go ahead and put this aside and open this. So here we go. And you know I gotta do the crunch. Okay. Um, hum, hum, hum. Where's the there? It is, hair tab. And this is oh, this is so pretty. Okay, so this one is. Let me find the name. Uh, this one is Uberlicious. I'm assuming it's supposed to be like Ube, the, the purple yams or potatoes or whatever they are. But the hair swirl is covered in purple glitter. Now, what I will say that I don't love is the glitter is not encased in anything. It's not coming off. Like you can see my fingers. But I'm kind of not loving that. And I don't really like this texture either. So, But it looks really pretty when you move it around. Like you can see the glitter right there. There's a purple macaron up here. And the horn is a different kind of swirl than I've seen before. So that's really pretty. And you've got a little bit of like um, melted ice cream run kind of look on the wings. 
The body of this Myrmicorno is this really pretty lavender color. The eyes are a darker lavender. I think the macro might be a little bit of a darker lavender as well. And then you've got the Myrmicorno tail that is um, the uh, ice cream cone. Now, I don't collect Myrmicornos just for whatever reason. The, the tail doesn't appeal to me as much as the Unicornos. But I might actually keep this one because um, I love the lavender. And if it's part of the whole series, I might just keep it. So I'm going to put that guy back there. You guys will see it when I take you down. And then I'm going to try to keep things clear. I'm just going to put that away. All right, next one. So box. And I won't show you the collector's card or the sticker at this point because, as you can see, they are basically the same. So I'll put that back. I'll crunch this back because I love the crunch. And we have, okay, we have, you know what, let me pull this one out because I need a card to be able to tell you guys the names. Excuse me. Okay, so this one, is this about, oh, I don't, you guys, okay, hold on. I don't, so this one is called uh, Rocco Chaco. I think it's supposed to be Rocky Road, but I got to tell you guys, and I don't know if, tell me if you guys agree, this just looks dirty. Like, I know it's meant to be like, like melted ice cream with like run of like chocolate and caramel and stuff. But the first thing I noticed, especially from this side, I was like, oh my God, did this just get like run through the mud or something? It just, it just looks dirty. Oh, I know what this is supposed to be. It's the, uh, the, the ice cream tacos. I, I don't love this. I really wish that they had just done like a cream. This is kind of okay. This is okay. But like on the face, it just... Tell me, comment below and let me know, you guys. Like, what do you think? I think it just looks dirty and I'm really not here for it. Uh, everything else is really pretty. You've got the taco shape. You've got a little bit of a foil for the handle. You've got some chocolate in the front that kind of looks like a feather boa or like some sort of boa, which is really pretty. I really, really wish they had just left this, like this cream colored up here. I don't know. I'm going to let you guys just get a close look for a second and then let me know what you think because I'm I'm not loving it. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know because I'm, I'm really curious if it's just me. But, I mean, the rest of it's really pretty, but I really don't like this. So, anyway, um, let's put that away. And then the next one. Okay, this, oh, I like the colors on this one. Really pretty. Okay, so this is Choco Minty. Uh, and I think <laughs> this is really cute. I really like this one. It's kind of busy, but I kind of love everything about it. So you've got like strawberry ice cream, mint ice cream, chocolate cone for the horn, uh, cone down here dipped in chocolate, mint, some sort of sprinkle situation. You've got like an Oreo cookie poking out the back. You've got the cone at the top, and then there's a little bit of what some sort of purple drizzle on the ears. Like, it's a lot, but I love it. And the sprinkles, like, this is the whole lot of ice cream. This is the friend in the group that is just, it's uh, a lot. But I love it. I love the colors. The mint and the pink and the blue and the chocolate. This is just so great. So, there you go. Love it. I'm going to put that over there. Put that box to the side. Next one up, we have and this one is okay. Um, correct me if I'm wrong because I don't know the names very well, but I think this is a basically an ice cream version of Stellina. Is that right? I don't know. You guys tell me. Anyway, this is Stellina Pop. Oh my God, I am right. Hello. Yes, I do remember. Okay, so really cute. You've got, can you see that? There's a little bit of a drizzle right there. It's, it's um, melted ice cream from the horn. The eyes are like cartoony and have a little bit of the eye shine right there. And then this part is matte and this part is shiny. These stars are shiny, this star is not. Can you see that? You've got the ice cream stick up here. So theoretically you could hold her like this, which is kind of cool. 
and then the rest of it like the ears look like they're melting the hair looks like it's melting it's really neat I like this redo a lot because it's not just literally the same mold in different colors it's a re oh look at that super melty hair it's a re-sculpt which is fabulous you've got melting on the outside of the wings and melting on the tail and there's something about like it just looks a little more rough and not as smooth as the original and I that makes sense because it's ice cream and I really like that. This is super cute. And again, I'm getting a kick out of doing this like it's real ice cream. But anyway, super cute. I like that one a lot. Put that back. Work our way down. There we go. Where is it? There it is. We have... Ooh, this one's so pretty. Okay, so this one is Aloha Swirl. Oh, this one's so pretty. So she's got pineapple hair. Oh, it's meant to be like some sort of smoothie or drink or something because she's got a straw up here. Can you see that? I don't know if y'all can see it. Um, So this is like a translucent, like maybe uh, sorbet type thing. And you've got, look at the swirls of yellow in her hair. And then it's down here in the tail. And then you've got this like, I don't know, maybe ice slushy is what it's meant to be. It feels like a different type of plastic. And actually, she's a little bendy because of it. So I'll hold her so you guys can see it. She's this like really cool faded yellow color. And so are her wings. And she's got a little bit of the melt on the wings too. Like I think all of these have the melted wing because they're all different types of ice cream. I like that the horns are different styles of swirls. Like this one's more pointy. That one's more rounded. This one's dripping. This one's an ice cream cone. So that's really cool. I like the differences. Um, but yeah, I really like the colors on this one. You've got the green Toki Doki logo on the chest. Um, and just... And I don't know it's different and it's really pretty and bright like it makes me want like I don't know um a pineapple uh if anyone's ever been to Disneyland what are those called um you know what I mean the I don't know I can't think of it uh but the frozen yogurt type slushy things these are really pretty I like it a lot a Dole Whip that's what I were that's the word I was looking for because I want some sort of pineapple Dole Whip because she's so pretty and can we talk about this adorable little drink hat uh umbrella drink hat I'm losing my words today because it's so cute, you guys. Look at it. I love it. All right. I'm going to put this one over here. She definitely stands because the bottom is like rubbery and really keeps it from moving around too much. I love it. Put that away. Next one down. Who do we have? There we go. We have... Ooh, you know what's so weird? Okay, so first of all, let me tell you, this one's called Orange Creamy. And okay, this is gonna sound weird, but I don't hate this swirl. Maybe there's too many colors. Maybe it's because the other one's brown, but I really like this one. It's all super shiny here. You've got a little orange peel and you've got this orange and vanilla marble effect that I like so much more than the chocolate one. And uh, she's got a, like a creamsicle picture on her butt here on one side and orange on the other she's got a little creamsicle here so she's obviously meant to be displayed this way she's got the typical unicorn horn with uh, a variation of orange and white and just like I really really like this one I like the colors in this one I don't know the hair is matte and the rest of her is super shiny and I think that helps too because this one is not as shiny and it again goes towards the dirty look that I'm really not a fan of but orange creamy is very pretty. I like her a lot. Again, makes me want an orange cream simple. Right, the side. Um, next one. Okay. And we have. Who do we have? Oh, we don't need this. Oh my God, the colors. Oh my God, you guys, I can't. It's so pretty. Uh, her name is Mochita, I think. Oh, she's the, this one's my favorite. The colors, the purple one's a close second, but like it's this super translucent light pink and sort of yellow and green. And you've got the little mochis on the stick here. And again, you've got the melted ice cream horn, 
these colors though you've got like this white drizzle around the body and that just like the pink and like they mixed I think different amounts of pink in the vinyl because there's a gradient from dark green to light green and then from here light pink to dark pink and then her hooves uh, back is pink and green front is two white ones this one is so pretty and can you see the like glitter and little white particles. I don't know what this is supposed to be, but I love it so much. I don't know if it's supposed to be shaved ice with uh, the mochi on it. And she's got a whole other mochi stick on the back, which is really cool. And the colors are different too. So the one on her hair is green, yellow, pink. The one on her back is pink, yellow, green. So it's kind of flipped upside down. Really cool. Look at the ears. You've got a little bit of darkness and shading down here. She is my favorite. Look at her so pretty all right next one away one more okay so what we have left is rainbow snow and or the chase so those are the two so let's see what we get my last crinkle let me enjoy it All right, here we go. And we have, ooh, so we have uh, Rainbow Snow. So similar to her, but a little bit darker on the colors, but still really pretty, because this one is completely clear. There's no little bits of anything inside. And she's got a little, one of those, um, those paper straws or sticks or whatever in her hair. And this is definitely meant to be uh, slushy or a snow cone, because the texture of this, can you see the texture? It's very icy textured and it goes all the way down to her hair and then it's in her tail too and it's color gradient too because you start at yellow go to green back down to yellow and down to pink and the same thing on her tail really pretty i really love that color and then the white i'm assuming is meant to be that little triangle cup that you hold and just like here and actually if you can see it they've done a little bit of a raised area here where a cup would naturally be raised so really well thought out really detailed i like that a lot um really pretty so this is actually the entire series minus the case uh let me i'm gonna take you guys down so you can see what they look like and uh you guys can see what they look like face forward um so here's what they look like i don't know if y'all can see it actually let me see if i can move this and if that makes a difference light wise so there's that I'm going to pan slowly so you guys can see them. They're really pretty, especially this end. Look at that. That's one hell of a collection. Um, yeah, the only one I'm not thrilled about is the chocolate one. But these are all really pretty. Uh, I am most likely going to keep the whole series, even though I'm not thrilled with the chocolate one. I like the idea of owning the whole series. I didn't get the chase, but I wasn't expecting to get the chase. So, you know, business as usual. Um... But I think these will look really pretty because I think I'm going to display them in front of a black background. And as you can see, it pops really well. So um, I'm excited to put these up and look at them and enjoy them. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Comment below and tell me how you feel about the chocolate one or which one was your favorite um, or what you think about this series. Because I'm kind of excited. This one's a fun one. It's different. So thanks for watching and I will see you guys later. Bye.